If you have ever wondered how to find good use for your older generation LCD TV rather than send it to the eco station, you know that it can be hard to find one. Although the TV probably supports high definition, chances are that it does not match modern television standards like Full HD or 4K. My old LCD TV is HD ready, meaning it is just basic HD 720p resolution. It's also got a ton of other inputs like component and VGA signal that I can no longer find use for. So what I want to do in this video is see if I can find use for this LCD TV by turning it into a decent smart TV. Hopefully I can use my smart TV to play fitness or exercise videos from the internet and help me keep up with my exercise goals. Now this is going to be on a tight budget so hopefully you'll be able to apply what I do here to a setup that you might want to do. So let's get going. I found a Google Chromecast device that I remember using at some point for streaming videos from the internet. I don't remember how I had set it up in the past but that's okay as I'm going to reset the device anyway. Google Chromecast devices like the one I have here are available to buy online or from leading retailers for an approximate price of $70. To reset my Chromecast device I need to first power it on and connect it to my TV. I can then follow the on-screen instructions to hopefully help along the reset process. I'm going to use the USB cable that is included with the Chromecast device, making sure that its connectors correctly match those of the Chromecast device and its power supply unit. I've plugged the HDMI cable that came with the Chromecast device into an HDMI input port of my TV. Not surprisingly, my Chromecast device lets me know that it cannot connect to the internet. Hopefully, by resetting my Chromecast device, It'll get rid of any old configuration in the device and provide an option to freshly set up internet access. To reset the device, I locate this tiny button next to the micro USB connector and press it down until the light turns a steady white. Once the device is reset, it prompts me to obtain the Google Home app and perform the remaining steps for setup. This means that I now need to grab my smartphone and launch the Google Home app. Google Home is able to detect my Chromecast. I follow the next set of instructions on the Google Home app on my phone to pair up Google Home and my Chromecast device. Now, you may notice that my Google Home complains that it cannot find Chromecast even after following the suggested steps. My Google app suggested that I double check my Wi-Fi router for options like UPnP and Guest Mode to fix this issue. In my case though, the problem went away just by simply restarting Google app and I was able to configure Google Home and Chromecast successfully without needing to change any of my router configuration. The last step is to launch the YouTube app on my smartphone, search and select my favorite fitness video and cast that video onto my LCD TV. 